I don't think there's anything I value more in life than originality. There are three questions in life that I consider to be the most important questions anyone can ever ask. Question one, who is better, the Backstreet Boys or Sync? Question two, do I look fat in this dress? And question three, how can I be more original? Now when it comes to originality, I'm a bit of a self-proclaimed expert. I customize almost everything I own. My EDC firearm, my holster, my knife. I have a skateboard with a cactus in my living room. My body, my skateboard. Carver. Yum, 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 yum. My rollerblade. Scott Quinn. Oh yeah. I find that originality is the key to our existence. No two people were ever made the same. And I feel like mass production of things tries to make people have the same thing to make everyone the same so everyone buys the same things. And it kind of makes us invisible. So a few days ago I posted on Facebook that if anyone ever saw me vlogging they should come up to me and say hi and if they did they would be in my vlog. And then Michelle mentioned how would anyone really know it's you if you're wearing a mask. Not that there are many vloggers in Cape Town that I see but it is a valid point. And I came to the conclusion it's time to customize one of my most prized possessions. My Oakley kitchen sink backpack. People tend to get a bit frissy when it comes to expensive things. That is a 4,000 Rand backpack. And the cost of things shouldn't determine whether or not you make them original. In fact, I believe the more expensive the item, the more originality or the more original you should make it. The problem is that we're taught to fear originality. We're taught to believe that someone else made something better than what we think we could make it, or someone else made something for us and we can't do it any better. And society makes us think that customizing something in order to stand out is bad, when in fact it is the most important facet of originality. The originality equation is quite simple. Increase individualism, and decrease fear of judgment. The tools required are quite simple. You need masking tape, protective shades, imagination, and most importantly, Rustoleum. Q Rustoleum ad. Rustoleum. Spray it. Don't say it. <laughs> Sorry. Let's do it again. Rustoleum. Spray it on your pet and call it petroleum. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't use Rustoleum, then I'll see you in hell. Now, if you want to increase your originality and make making things a lot simpler, you can get yourself a Michelle Janison. They are very hard to find and they are very expensive. Like very, very expensive. Like extremely... Wow. Hey? What are you saying? No, I say you have a nice face. This is my backpack. There are none like it because this one is mine.